At the end of Highway 87 near Port Bolivar, only a few cars were ahead of her in line for the ferry. A guide waved Dory into the correct lane and her car clanked over the loading ramp, announcing her arrival. Birds watched from their perches nearby, grooming disheveled plumage, occasionally grumbling to one another. They'd seen it all a million times. Equally bored guards in orange and silver vests waved on more passengers. A loudspeaker competed with the drone of the engine, welcoming them aboard and stating the ferry rules. No smoking. Stay in your vehicle until the ferry departs. The latter of which most people ignored. Then the horn signaled the ferry's departure and seagulls congregated overhead, singing their ocean stories in exchange for scraps of bread. Looming up ahead, the SS Selma's torn hull exposed rusted innards, making it appear vulnerable despite its massive bulk. A concrete vessel launched in 1919 The ferry shared the water with numerous other vessels, behemoth tankards and barges, dazzling white cruise ships with waving passengers, shrimp boats and speedboats zipping by like wind-up toys. At Seawolf Park, a few fishermen tried their luck, shadowed by the USS Kabbalah, a World War II submarine that lay in state. <laughs>